if the freedom of speech is taken away then dumb and silent we may be led, like sheep to the slaughter. To be prepared for war is one of the most effective means of preserving peace. Truth will ultimately prevail where there is pains to bring it to light. Be courteous to all, but intimate with few, and let those few be well tried before you give them your confidence. Liberty, when it begins to take root, is a plant of rapid growth. True friendship is a plant of slow growth and must withstand adversity shocks before it is entitled to the appellation. The foolish and wicked practice of profane cursing and swearing is a vice so mean and low that every person of sense and character detests and despises it. Observe good faith and justice toward all nations. Cultivate peace and harmony with all. The time is near at hand which must determine whether Americans are to be free men or slaves. Discipline is the soul of an army. It makes small numbers formidable, procures success for the weak, and esteem to all. Worry is the interest paid by those who borrow trouble. Labor to keep alive in your breast that little spark of celestial fire, called conscience. My first wish is to see this plague of mankind, war, banished from the earth. We should not look back unless it is to derive useful lessons from past errors, and for the purpose of profiting by dearly bought experience. I hope I shall possess firmness and virtue enough to maintain what I consider the most enviable of all titles, the character of an honest man. It will be found a fit of unjust and unwise jealousy to deprive a man of his natural liberty upon the supposition he may abuse it. Laws made by common consent must not be trampled on by individuals. Happiness and moral duty are inseparably connected. Someday, following the example of the United States of America, there will be the United States of Europe. When we assumed the soldier, we did not lay aside the citizen.